Hello, this is your girl Crystal from Ball Black Girls Chronicles. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome, welcome, welcome back. If you haven't already done so, consider subscribing to my channel, hitting that bell notification so you are notified of the next time I upload a video. So I know I keep saying this, I think I said what I'm gonna do is make a note to myself that I'm committing to, <laughs> well, I'm not committing to anything. I can't commit to nothing else because I have fallen short drastically. Um, but what I said, it feels like I only upload, you know, videos around the same time or whatever each month or so, once a month. It's just, gosh, I don't know what my problem is. Um, so what's been going on? Well, we got snow. Can you believe that foolishness? We got snow and, and what do you call those icicles? I was distraught and I, I went outside. I took me and Tabitha went outside when it was snowing and Tabitha, I wouldn't say she loved it. She didn't hate it though, but the little neighbor girl across the way, she was getting her play on in the snow. She was tickled pink to have snow. Mama right here was disturbed. I was like, I'm moving tomorrow because uh, I didn't sign up for no snow. I ain't signed up to be in no snow place. <laughs> My girlfriend was like, okay, let's not be hasty here. It snows once every 10 to 15 years. <laughs> Anywho, so I had to deal with the weather, winter weather here in the South. Um... Tabitha, if you if you haven't seen her in any of my videos today that I've uploaded, Tabitha is going for her first heartworm treatment today. So I dropped her off this morning, um, and then I'll go pick her up a little later today, um, and hopefully she does well. I'll do a video. You'll get a chance to see her then. They say it is not a... Um, nice treatment they say it is painful but l let's hope she's a trooper and that she does well so i go pick her up for later today what am i talking about today my bag now you know uh i talk about coach like a dog all the time don't i but this is my coach bag you know i love um i love camouflage type stuff you know and you see that you see the signature C's are camouflaged in that camo kind of uh, leather there. Um, this is, I love this bag. I do love this bag. You see that? I love most bags that I have like are, that are a tote that has like the top handles here. I love that. And then it offers the shoulder strap or crossbody strap. You know, I talk about them like a dog with this nylon strap. Coach, this is coach thing. I don't know what they're doing about these nylon straps, but with this bag, it fits to me. It fits because it's it got a little kind of rustic looking look to it with it being a camouflage style bag. Um, but this is what I'm carrying. So take a look at it. Again, this is, um, I call her a her, but he, sh he should be a him because it's traditionally a man's bag. Uh, when I bought it, which God knows I was traveling somewhere and who knew where, where it was, but um, they had this bag in the men's section of their coach outlet store. So uh, let's talk about the bag a little bit. I love it has two big pockets. They have this, the, the um, magnetic snap sleeve type pocket over here. You see, I got some more readers. Sleeve top type pocket here in the back. And then in the front area, it has this really big zip pocket, which is awesome. Um, that's where I actually keep you member. So let's let's talk about what's in my bag since we're on this. This is where I keep my um, my my main wallet, right? So this is where my Brahmin goes, um, which houses most of my stuff. Look, I got a receipt. Guess where that receipt is from? Just take a wild guess. I'm telling you, I'm finna get some stuff. Um, my lipstick case. You remember that? I bought a new one. Where'd it go? If you haven't seen my video yet uh, that I did about uh, my shopping when I got off my shopping um, diet, I bought a new lipstick case. So this one is a Brighton. Um, 
really pretty, pretty, pretty. But this is my Coach lipstick case. Um, my little glove there. And then my Coach um, card holder that holds all my credit cards and whatnot. Um, this joke is super cute. Now, I tell you, for me to always be talking about Coach like a dog, I got a lot of Coach in here. My Coach wallet. I love, love, love this. A vintage wallet. Love, love, love this vintage wallet. Um, it ha it offers the gold tone Chris kiss class for your coins. And then, you know, for your cash, because I'm rolling in the dough with all these singles. <laughs> and then the snap closure. I love that. And then, um, oh, my earbud. I got to put that away. So, and then um, some hand sanitizer. Gosh. Girl, I got like, I need to get a brush and brush this out. I got like crumbs in here. I wonder what this, oh, this is Kroger's. Um, I gotta, gosh, dump this out. I hate to dump it out. Luckily, I need to be sweeping my floor anyway. Oh, I need a brush. I need a brush to brush that out. So that's what I keep in that pocket, mainly because it's easier for me to grab my wallet or if I need to put on some lipstick or, you know, my hand sanitizer or whatever the case may be. It's really easy to do that um, um, with this, with my Brahma right in that pocket. I still don't zip it, girl. So if that pocket was open, all my little goodies will fall out. I don't think I have anything else in this front pocket. Let's see. Um... So let's put that back in there. That's what goes in there. And you remember, I love my Brahmin. I use it all the time, mainly because if I don't want to carry the big old bag, I just pull out my Brahmin and I walk around with that that um, that um, clutch. Um, so what else do I have in here? More Coach. Go figure. As much as I talk about Coach. And then you remember my, my Patricia Nash with my keys. We'll talk about that because I need to find my earbuds here. You know, I, I told you already I lost one of my earbuds. I still don't know where it is, girl. I got to figure that out. But that gun is supposed to be right there. That's supposed to be in here. So I still have my, um, my Patricia Nash. I still love that. It's supposed to house my earbuds and my keys. That's the beauty of when you're doing what's in your bag. It makes me organize my bag and I can talk to y'all. <laughs> um, put my keys. You remember my coach keychain? Now I've been looking at keychains. What I want now is that Dooney and Burp duck or that coach bear. But I do like my um, coach keychain with the C because my name is Crystal. That C does not stand for coach. It stands for Crystal. I'm just saying. <laughs> Because I am Crystal with the C. So get my keys in there. And then my car key is also attached here. And then what else do I have in here? My glasses. You remember I was going to buy me a new, um, and I left my uh, other glass, eyeglass holder in the car. I was going to put by, uh, buy me another Dooney and Burke eyeglass holder. But I found this. And it works. It just has my readers in it. It's not a big deal. Um, now, I have something else in here. Now, I can take this out. I was carrying it around because, um, because um, you know, we were going through that storm or whatever. And I wanted to, just in case the power went out, I wanted to be able to do that. But it's just my little um, flashlight. So, I'm going to put this back in my room. It does not need to be in my purse. Mm -hmm. And then the inside of the bag, I, don't, I think that's all I have in the bag. Now, what? Oh, see, this is crazy. Now, I was looking for my mask. I had this lady. I have two people that make masks for me. And this one lady, she does a really, really good job. So, I had bought this floral pattern um, fabric. And then she did, because I love flowers. She did this mask for me. So, that's my mask. My reusable one. And then, um, <clears throat> so, what kind, let me see. Oh, this is just a guide, the care guide. It does not give me the name of this bag. It's just a care guide. So, that's all I have in here. I don't have anything else in here. So, this is the inside of the bag. Can you see that? There you go. Oh, what's that? 
Oh no, that just put that in there. Um, yep, so that's it. But I really, really um, enjoy carrying this bag. I do, I do, I do. And you remember I talked about the fact that I have, I um, own a lot of um, green, more green than I thought I did. And so um, to be able to pull out this bag, and you remember my other coach bag that I like, my coach tote that I have, um, it also offers the green. I really, really like carrying that too. And I didn't think I was, but I actually do. So I do not, I wish I could tell you the name of this bag. I'm gonna see if they have a, 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 a number on it. Let's see. It does, let me tell you what that number is. It's um, F72, gosh, I should put on my glasses, 72627. So let's look it up and see if we can get a name for it. F72627, I think is what it is. Oh gosh. I think that's what it was, 627. F72, um, no, 72527, that's 527. See, that's why you need your glasses on. Yes, that's what it is. So this one, it can flap over like this. You know, I just never use it as a flap over, but it can do that. So they call this the, the men's gram fold over messenger bag. So it's called um, the gram fold over messenger bag. That's the name of this bag. And like I said, it was a men's, traditionally a men's bag, but I, I love, I love, love, love it. Um, so too bad men, uh, it's not my bag. So yeah, but it's called the men's gram signature cameo print crossover fold over tote. Yep, so that's this bag. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you, you as a woman, buy men's bags that you see that you like. Do you have any men's bags that you like? Hey, I'm going to rock this bag. I don't care if it was in the men's section. Uh, let me know what your thoughts are. I can't wait to see your comments. Um, please know I read them all and then I do try to respond as quickly as I possibly can. Um, don't forget, if you haven't already done so, don't forget to su subscribe to my channel, hit that bell notification, and then um, like the video and comment. Thank you so much for joining me today, and don't forget, if nothing else, be good to yourself. Bye, YouTube. Until then, till next time, be good.